Pavel McKay, seen here in a driver's license photo, is the man sheriff's detectives are looking for. He's the man they say broke into a house earlier this morning and assaulted a woman. He then took off. The suspect vehicle was heading eastbound. Our deputy was heading westbound, responding to the call. Saw the vehicle. Uh, the suspect saw the officer park the car, or abandon the vehicle in a driveway. That driveway belongs to the Duncan family. They were asleep at the time when their phone rang. I was in my pajamas and we were had to get ready and then they're like, you have a few minutes, grab what you need, get out. McKay ditched his truck with a boat attached in their driveway and then took off. He hopped out and ran in our backyard. And so that's why they were worried that they were he was in our house. Streets were shut down, school was closed, and the East Metro SWAT team was called in. A mile-wide perimeter was set up hoping to catch McKay. I was like shaking and I didn't even realize it until after I'd woken them up, but like you just you just don't expect that to wake up to on like a Tuesday morning. But in an area full of trees and bushes, he could be anywhere. There's plenty of stuff like wooded areas to go and hide and I don't know I feel very nervous kind of scary because you don't know what kind of person it is that's out there or what they really did yet. Deputies are in contact with his family again he's still outstanding they're trying to find him. Uh, the woman who was assaulted should be okay I'm told she has minor injuries but was encouraged to go to the hospital to get checked out. If you know where McKay is or if you uh, see him don't approach him, just call 911.